up this tree, roots and all, and uh, transplanted it in front of Jonathan's house. So we'll see if, um, if it'll take. It might, might not. Done some before and they took, but then, you know, sometimes they just don't. We'll have to see. We'll give it some. Oh, I'll have to get my Thrive Drops, yeah, um, and give it to them. So, hopefully, Jonathan will have a nice little tree in front here. Give him some shade on his little front porch. This is the before behind our house. Well, kind of the before because I already cleaned out a, a bunch of this dead brush. I'm moving these rocks and I've still got all that to get out and that to get out and you can see there's a lot a lot a lot of rocks and then I'm going to get rid of the cedar it's my favorite thing to do for wonders so I'll show you the four other. hours uh, Greenworks 40 volt um, cordless chainsaw, a 16 inch, and some sweat will get you. Here you have it. It's all cleared out. I'll cut that down further or decide what we're going to do with it. But I just wanted it cleared out for now. And you see how it is. You cut down some cedars, and there's 50 billion more cedars right behind it. So got all that dead stuff out of there so I actually taught myself a new song to try to amuse myself while I'm working out here and it goes like this 99 cedar trees to cut down 99 cedars cedar trees to cut cut one down burn it to the ground 98 cedar trees to burn and also, I'll not very good song that was on it one battery charge and it still has charge it outlasts me I don't know how Greenworks did it, but this is absolutely the most amazing saw. Not only did I it cut really all of this that you see here, it cut all this. And no, all we're not done yet. And that, the dead stuff is the stuff that I pulled out from underneath the trees. Oh my gosh. It felt so good to have it all cleared out last time, have it all burned. But now, I guess. It's time to bribe the grandkids again.